peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Jesus down in my heart. I love to sing the joy of living is Jesus down in my heart. There's peace, great peace in knowing that he never shall depart. And love, joy, peace are overflowing every time I start to sing the joy of living is Jesus down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Jesus down in my heart. I love to sing the joy of living. Is Jesus down in my heart? There's peace, great peace in knowing that he never shall depart. And love, joy, peace are overflowing every time I start to sing the joy of living. Is Jesus down in my heart? There's love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Jesus down in my heart. I love to sing the joy of living. Is Jesus down in my heart? There's peace, great peace in knowing that he never shall depart. And love, joy, peace are overflowing every time I start to sing the joy of living. Is Jesus down in my heart? Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Jesus 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 down in my heart. The joy of living. Love, joy, peace. I love that theme. I took that from... 1 Peter chapter 1, verses 8 and 9. I'm Pastor Brad Winnegar. This is from the Shepherd of the Sheep, an original song today for our devotional. Turn with me, if you would, 1 Peter 1, 8 and 9. Whom having not seen, that's Jesus Christ, ye love. In whom, though now ye see him not, yet believing, ye rejoice with joy unspeakable and full of glory, receiving the end of your faith, even the salvation of your souls. I've got to think about our children as they were growing up, and of course we exposed them to the Christian life from the very beginning, actually before they were born. And uh, I'm sure that as they came into this world, they thought it very strange as they sat in their high chairs at the dinner table that at the end of each meal, after we had uh, eaten, and enjoyed a wonderful meal and fellowship together as a family, we would take a big book and we would be talking from that book. And then we would close our eyes and take their hands and we'd be talking out loud to somebody that they couldn't see. What strange, <laughs> what strange creatures these parents are that, are that are talking out loud with their eyes closed to somebody I can't even see in the room. But they were introduced early to the 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 absolute foundational truth that there is a God and that He is the God of the Bible and He loves us and He has done something to transform us from the inside out. And He's given us the Holy Spirit who is the down payment, the earnest of our inheritance. We know we're going to heaven because we've got the Holy Spirit, the down payment. And uh, we have the fruit of the Spirit being manifested out of our life, love, joy, peace, etc., and uh, Jesus in my heart is the reason for the love, the joy, and the peace. Praise God for that truth that even little children can recognize that something is different. Something is different from the rest of the world that don't have that joy, that love, joy, and that peace down in their soul. How about you today? Do you have the joy of living, love, joy, peace? Do you have that? 
you have Jesus down in your heart, let's pray. Father, we thank you for those today who claim the name of Jesus Christ as personal Savior. And I ask, Lord, that we might share him with everyone. With our heads bowed and eyes closed, if you don't know Jesus Christ today, then right now, won't you join me in prayer? Ask him to come in right now. Pray something like this. Dear God, I admit that I'm a lost sinner. I need a Savior. I'm asking Jesus Christ to come in. I'm receiving him right now as my personal Savior. Take away my sins. Pay my sin penalty. Take me to heaven when I die. And if you prayed that prayer, won't you let us know that we might uh, rejoice with you and help you in your Christian life. And right now, if you're a soul winner, keep on. And if you're needy, if you're hurting right now, look to Jesus. That's where our joy, that's where our the love, that's where the peace, that's where the happiness is to be found. Father, thank you that you can meet our needs. We bring them to you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. All right. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Love, joy, peace down in my heart. Jesus down in my heart. God bless you today. are listening to From the Shepherd to the Sheep Daily Devotionals. This is a ministry of Central Baptist Church in Woodbridge, Virginia. If you would like to learn more about our ministries, you can find us online at cbcwoodbridge.org. You will also find many other helpful resources there, including preaching, devotionals, and songs. We thank you for listening to this devotional, From the Shepherd to the Sheep.